Checking Democracy 2012 now, less than 45 days to go before the November election, and things are really heating up. We could say that nationally and locally. Yeah, you've probably seen it. A host of attack ads hitting the airwaves this week, including several in Arizona's 9th Congressional District, featuring Democrat Kirsten Cinema and Republican Vernon Parker. So tonight, as always, ABC 15's Tim Vetcher puts an ad from the American Future Fund attacking Cinema to a fact check. She's changed her words, hiding who she really is. In this 30-second ad, the American Future Fund questions whether Kirsten Cinema's views reflect the majority of Arizonans. Kirsten Cinema supported income and sales tax hikes that will drive up the cost of everyday living for struggling families. That's fiction. In this Project Vote Smart candidate survey from 2006, Cinema did indicate she would, quote, greatly increase income taxes, but only for those who make more than $75,000. Not exactly struggling families, as the ad claims. She described herself as a socialist. That's misleading. The quote comes from an interview with the now defunct 944 magazine, a fashion and lifestyle publication. Cinema referred to herself as a quote Prada socialist while describing her wardrobe. And Kirsten Cinema attacked stay-at-home moms, calling them leeches. That's a fact. In the same interview, Cinema did refer to women quote leeching off their husbands or boyfriends. Cinema apologized and claimed the interview with 944 was tongue-in-cheek. Do you agree with Kirsten Cinema? This November, tell Kirsten Cinema she's too extreme for Arizona. The Cinema campaign released a statement to ABC 15 that reads, quote, This is a typically dishonest smear ad from a shady out of state group. Arizona voters are too smart to fall for this trash. American Future Fund is responsible for the content of this advertising. I'm Tim Vetcher, ABC 15 News.